I got a marijuana start for you. If I could just remember it. You know what I'm talking about, right? It's going to bring $65 billion to the Washington state economy this next year. Can you imagine that? Can you imagine what you could do with $65 billion? Yes. Boggles the imagination. Anyway, my marijuana story. So, back in 1996, 96, I was writing uh, music for an album called Here in the Now Frontier. Oh, you remember that album? I'm glad you do, because I barely remember that one. Now, marijuana wasn't legal in Washington at the time, but there was a lot of it, and a lot of really good marijuana, if I might add. Now, we were in the studio recording and writing, and uh, I was looking for a topic. And uh, I had something that was like, you know, in the back of my mind, but I couldn't put my finger on it, I couldn't quite bring it into words, or I couldn't find the sound, and, uh, as they say. And um, this friend of ours came over uh, and catered the entire studio uh, session that day. And uh, they brought all their, their famous food that they made, and uh, wine, and uh, specialty items, and uh, we were all feasting, and at the end of the feast, um, our friend Bob, he said, uh, oh, uh, by the way, uh, I put uh, quite a lot of marijuana in uh, the dessert tonight, so I just wanted to tell you. I, I don't know, you know, like if you've ever smoked pot or uh, ingested it, it, at the time when you're when you, when you, it's like it takes a while for it all to kick in, right? And when it does kick in, it's like, whoa! Well, that's the way it was for me. I immediately got the idea for this next song. And uh, if the band would like to start playing the song. It, it kind of goes like this. 